Hello and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today's video is a really exciting collab with my beautiful, wonderful friend and sister from another mister over here on YouTube. That's Bridget, beauty goddess Bridget. I can't speak today, it's getting late. Um, we decided to collab with another one of Nomad's palettes and Bridget suggested we call it the Traveller series. Um, both of us do love um, Nomad's eyeshadow palettes. So we decided to collab this time using the Cartagena Magica, Magica. My pronunciation is terrible. I love this palette. I love all of Nomad's palettes. Um, so yes, we decided just to uh, go ahead and use this one. Um, so I'm gonna get started and we'll have a chat whilst we're going. I have primed my eyes with the ABHI primer. Um, I know it and love it. And I'm first going to go into La Diosa Coronada. I'm, I'm hoping that I'm saying that right. I'm probably not. Um, just make sure that the primer is patted down. So Bridget's still fairly new to YouTube. Um, she is another, um, I'm going to place this through my crease. She is another lover of colourful makeup. And she does all different kinds of videos. Um, you're, all of them, you're guaranteed to get a laugh because she just lives the craziest life like not crazy in a bad way crazy in a good way and her and her other half jay are hilarious they're so funny and bridge is just one of the most genuine wonderful honest and open people that you could meet she's so lovely and she deserves a lot more a lot more love than she gets um, over here on YouTube. I am always, I always come away like really in a really good mood after I've watched her videos. Um, and yeah, she does, um, is it Ipsy opening? She does like unboxing videos, reviews, just general fun. And she does a lot of lives over on Facebook also i will link bridget's channel and her video in the description box below oh, i love this this is so nice i'm keeping kind of a rounded shape because i'm gonna do a halo eye and uh i think it's gonna look nice i hope so i did get my base on beforehand um about a couple of hours ago now actually because i thought oh okay jace who is my 17 week old puppy was a bit sleepy so i thought oh excellent i'll just take him upstairs he can lay on the bed and i can get filming um no no that that's not what happened at all jace had completely other ideas so i've had to wait for kira and Dave to come and take over puppy sitting um, so that I could film so yeah if my well not that I'm ever kind of <laughs> I can never speak properly I'm always mispronouncing things and forgetting what I'm saying and I always blame the medication I'm on um, but I have no excuse at the moment because I'm in the midst of changing pain medications um, because the one that I've been on for ages just hasn't been doing well anything really. Um, so yes, I can only blame my brain. <laughs> okay, so I am next going to go into Optro Demonios. Demonios, this one here. Again, I can only apologise for my terrible pronunciation. I'm sure Bridget will get it right because she speaks Spanish along with, I believe it was the Romance language she got a degree in. And uh, so, yes, she is bound to 
to get all of this correct whereas I get it terribly wrong. <laughs> um, I didn't say what brushes I was using did I? Um, again I'm always forgetting that too. Um, the first one I used was a Made by Mitchell ME1 and then I'm using a Spectrum A12. Um, this is a brush you'll see me use a lot because I love these brushes and I have a few. So yeah, Bridget and I have collabed a few times now. Um, it's always so much fun. I might have gone in a little bit too far with that. Oh, never mind. Never mind. It's all good. It's all good. All part of the fun. <laughs> um, Halo eyes are not my speciality. But they're fun. So I thought we'd go with fun. Um... Yeah, we we were talking about palettes that we have and both of us are huge fans of Nomad. Nomad Cosmetics is one of my favourite brands and I believe one of Bridget's favourites also. It's just, well, Felicia and Auntie are just wonderful people to start. I love the theme that they go with on places that they've been. Um... I love that they they raise money for for charities. They're just really lovely, lovely people, and the formula of their eyeshadows is one of my absolute favourites. Um, I do have the new palette. Um, trying to find time to film at the moment with a young pup is not easy. Um, it it wasn't particularly easy, anyways, with. Um, never knowing what my pain levels are going to be like on a day um but with a pup as well it's yeah so i am going to be doing a first impression with that for karma chameleon this week just to make sure that i get the video up or get it used while it's still new i'm just not not on top of things at the moment at all. God, these shadows are just beautiful. Beautiful. And I haven't used this palette for a while. So, uh, yeah, definitely was pleased to be using this one. Yeah, we did um, the last collab. Um, the last collab? No. The one before last. We used the um, the newer Haunted Europe palette. I have not done a great job here at all. Hmm. Okay, this is this is not my best work. We're just gonna go with whatever's going. Oh my word. I was up all night in pain last night, so I managed to get some sleep on the sofa this morning along with the pup and the cat. <laughs> yeah, I'm not particularly with it this evening, which is evening for me now. And so our collab was originally due to go up today um, but it's, uh, yeah, it's been a week. No fallout. We're doing good. We're doing good. I'm going to go back in with the Les La Diosa Coronado, the first shade. And I'm just taking a little bit of that and just going to blend over the edges there. So yeah, poor Bridget, I've already delayed it from today till tomorrow. And oh, I'm just not organised in the slightest at the moment at all. Oh, okay. And let's get a slightly fluffier brush. 
And I'm going to take a Made by Mitchell ME3 and I'm going to go into, is it Toda La Vida? The yellow map. Um, so yes, I am already late, which I hate being, I hate being late for anything. Um, luckily Bridget is such an understanding, wonderful person. Um, yeah, she, she gets, uh, my life's just never, never straightforward. Not that anyone's ever is, but. I think at the moment, oh, this is so pretty. I am going right up to my brow with this because uh, because I feel like it. <laughs> All the reason, and uh, yeah, also Bridget is another animal lover, so she completely gets what hard work puppies are. So worth it, but hard work. Um, and also like Jace's. I'm training to um I say he's, he's not in the training as yet but we're doing little things um with him he's going to be like a service dog for me um because I suffer with um complex regional pain syndrome and it can uh, come on well, I'm always in pain, but it can really flare up bad just with no notice at all. Um, so I can't really leave the house on my own for fear of, we'll see if that happens. Going back into La Diosa Coronada, the second one again. And I'm just going to blend that. Um, so yeah, Jace is being trained so that if... If I am to collapse in pain, like what what he can do, um, which essentially so is just kind of standing over me, but we're looking into um, other ways he can help. Obviously, that kind of training is quite a ways off because he is only 17 weeks old. But he already, if I'm having a really bad pain attack, knows, um, he knows and he will come and calmly rest either his, his paw or his head on my arm. Um, just kind of let me know he's there. Okay, I'm going to pop a bit of my NYX glitter primer just on the centre, just because I have done my base and... Ideally, I would like to not have fallout. <laughs> and I'm a, I'm a one for packing, packing my brush. So let's get some of this on. I'm just going to kind of pat it all over the centre there. Just taking it above my crease slightly so it shows with my eyes open okay right let's have a think right I think I am going to take the de, de one on a Morphia Madison beer kind of fluffy flat brush. I don't believe I've used this shade yet. And that one is going to go up like a kind of either side ish. Oh, these shadows are so pretty. Is unreal. And I'm just going to put this all the way across. Actually, oh, it's so pretty. I'm so excited to try the new palette, um, Whistler Snow Lodge. Um, it is in my cupboard behind me, and yes, I will be using it Saturday for Karma Chameleon which I'm pretty sure I've already said that 
just in case I have and it'll be um, tomorrow as you guys are watching this that is looking pretty I'm just gonna go back in with the brush that I used for true the most the, the deeper shade and I'm just going to kind of add a little bit more just to kind of blend the edges of that there and then just with another little kind of fluff, fluffy brush from Morphe and Madison Beer I'm going to dip into oh my word Perseguis Sueños the yellow shimmer oh crikey and I've dipped in there and I'm just gonna give that a spray just so I don't get any fallout and I'm going to plonk that, plonk that, place that, plonk it right in the centre just to really brighten it up oh. that is so pretty shadows are amazing yeah i'm looking forward to seeing what bridget does with the palette you know what, what look she comes up with i think this is you could go kind of neutral i guess with this but bridget's more along the colorful lines like myself so it's going to be a beautiful look okay that's looking pretty i'm just gonna take the brush that i used for otto otto demonios i'm terrible the deeper shade and i'm just going to just kind of bring that around onto my lower lash line there I'm not going to do the kind of same on the lower as I did on the top I'm just going to keep it pretty simple on the bottom okay so I'm just taking this little fluffy brush from Multitude Cosmetics and I'm going into Alpha which I believe is like a satin yellowy shade I haven't used it yet so uh, I want to yeah I think this is more of like a satin one but yeah I really wanted to I wanted to use it oh okay this packs a bigger punch than I was expecting And then just going into the yellow map. <laughs> I'm going to stop trying to pronounce these. I'm just going to take that right along the edges. Yeah. Ooh. What do I want to do? I think actually I want to, for the inner part of the lower lash line, go into Mars Intensa pink shimmer and I'm just going to take that on a Morphe M149 and I'm also going to give it a spray I'm just going to place that in the inner part there Ooh. just add a bit of Pink. Oh, I like that. And then I'm just going to take a prepped pencil brush and I'm going to go back into this yellow shimmer. I'm also going to give that a quick spray just 
to stop any fallout and I'm going to place that literally right on this inner corner oh look at that and then just bring it down into that pink a little bit this shimmer is just oh, so beautiful so beautiful well they all are but something about a yellow shimmer that just uh, it just looks magical I think is that just me? And I'm also going to take just the tiniest bit of that and I'm going to use that just to highlight under my brow there. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, I'm I'm loving how this is looking. So I'm going to nip off, finish my face, and then I'll come back to show you the finished look. So if you would like to see that, then uh, don't go anywhere. Okay, guys, so this is the finished look. Let me know what you think in the comments section below. I'm super excited to see Bridget's look. And I'll just going to quickly let you know a couple of the bits I popped on my face. Um, everything will be listed in the description box below. So if you do want to know what everything else is, it'll be down there. Um, the blush I went in with was the Sweet Cheeks Blush Trio from She, she Glam. I can't speak. And I went in with a mixture of these two shades there. They don't have names, but yeah. I went in with those and... I think that went really well and um, the highlighter I went in with is from makeup by Lisa it is the shade strobe oh my god this is amazing I love this so much um mascara because I decided to go without lashes um or falsies anyways um so this is the she glam um I think it's volume and length Mascara one side is like this brush for the lengthening and then the other side I'll get there eventually um, is this for the volume um, I go in with the volume then the length and I love what it does yeah highly recommend it um, for in my waterline I wanted to go with a metallic kind of yellow and this is the Colourpop Cream Gel Liner in the shade, I'm sure that says Sub-Zero. Um, but I really wanted to give that a go. Um, first time wearing it, I think it goes really well with this look. And then on my lips, um, I don't think you can get these anymore, um, unfortunately. They're both from P. Louise. The lip liner is in the shade Standards. And then the lipstick is in the shade Heights. Um... I love it. Um, yeah, I did have a look and I couldn't see either on the website. So apologies, but I really wanted to wear them. Um, so yeah, I cannot wait to see Bridget's video. One, I know she's just gonna have me in stitches. She always does. She is just so funny. Um, it's never a dull moment with Bridget around and that's a good thing. Um, I, I honestly couldn't imagine not having her in my life now i love her to bits i'm so excited that we're clubbing again and i'm going to be doing this traveler series of collabs i do love these series kind of things i find it really exciting so who knows where we're going to be next time but there will be a next time that's all you need to know right now so bridget thank you so much for collabing with me again and for your patience in just my complete disorganized life at the moment so i'm so sorry that i was late getting it filmed but i really enjoyed it i hope you did too so thank you so much my lovely again if you don't know who bridget is which by now you probably do 
I hope. If not, please go and check out her channel, her video, both linked in the description box below. Subscribe, like, comment, all of that wonderful stuff. And yeah, tell her I said hi. Not the really too hi, Bridget. Um, but anyways, if you've enjoyed this video, please give it a like thumbs up that really helps me out if you are new here um if you've come over from bridget's channel hi i'm steph i'm a huge lover of colorful makeup i love to support indie brands i love discovering new indie brands too um everything i use is cruelty free so yeah if that all sounds like something you'd be interested in then please do hit the subscribe button i also do karma chameleon every saturday 3 p.m uk time um most of the time it is a live and it's just like a virtual cafe get together we have a great time bridget is quite often there too it's just a nice little yeah get together chat makeup chat life so yeah hopefully i will see you there but yes again thank you bridget for collabing with me and thank you guys so much for watching this video and spending this time with me i appreciate every single one of you um so yeah thank you again for watching i hope you're all having a great day great evening wherever you are and whatever you're doing i hope you're taking care of yourselves i will see you again very very soon goodbye